So before we start off the actual video, I just want to give a quick shout out to Complete Science, Trident Hydra, and Norma Ramirez, who are the first three people to make response videos. Thank you guys so much. It's so fun watching them, and you guys are so awesome. So let, let's just start the actual video. Woo! Yo guys, what is up? It is Derek here from BGAK Derek, and in today's video, we're going to be talking about getting embarrassed. Now, we all have moments in life where we're going to be embarrassed. I mean, it's just basic human nature. I mean, sometimes you're going to fall and trip and you're going to get embarrassed. There's times where you're going to maybe spill food all over yourself and you're going to be embarrassed. There's times where you're going to fall in gym class and your dick is going to pop out and everyone's going to see it and make fun of how small it is for the rest of your life. That was a that was a bad day. <laughs> just, I'm just kidding. That didn't actually happen. <laughs> I never really get embarrassed. I mean, whenever something bad happens to me that I think would cause someone else to get embarrassed, I just think to myself, why would I be embarrassed right now? I mean, usually I just end up laughing at myself or just going along with it and pretending like I meant to do it as a joke, but getting embarrassed is something that no one should ever do. For example, let's say you fart in class. Now, I'm pretty sure guy or a girl, almost every single person has either farted in class or gotten blamed for farting in class. I remember one time actually where someone farted in class and it wasn't me and everybody just pointed at me and I'm pretty sure it was the girl sitting right next to me. Becky, you fucking stupid farting slut. <laughs> really, let's say you fart in class and everyone's looking at you, everyone's like, oh my god, <laughs> Derek, you farted. <laughs> you farted. And you're probably thinking to yourself at this moment, oh my god, man, I am so embarrassed. I farted. Everyone can smell it. Everyone can smell the Mexican food I ate last night. Everyone heard it. Oh my god, I'm so embarrassed! But let's say someone else in your class farts and everyone hears it and notices it. Now, when you hear that person fart, are you really laughing at them? Like, would you like them to feel embarrassed for that? No, you probably don't think, oh my god, that person farted. They should be so embarrassed that they're, they farted. I mean, they did a basic, humanly, bodily function. They should be embarrassed! I never understood that. Why do people think, like, why do people laugh at you when you fart? Everyone does it. I have to do it right. Oh. I, it's, it's a normal thing. If someone farts in your class and you are looking at them right now and you're thinking, oh my God, that person should be so embarrassed. They should just sit down and cry because of what they just did. You are a terrible person if you think that. If you think someone should be embarrassed for something like that, you deserve to be embarrassed for every single thing you do in the rest of your life. But when you are looking at someone who has done something embarrassed, they fell on the ground, they spilled something all over themselves. Me as a person, I usually don't think, oh my god, that person should feel embarrassed. I usually just think, wow, I feel really bad for that person. Because when you think about it, when you do something embarrassing, spill something on yourself, fall, you fart, you fucking get caught jacking off in the middle of class, you probably... Don't do that. No one is thinking, wow, you should be really embarrassed. You're an idiot. You're a loser. No, most people are just probably feeling bad for you that something unfortunate happened to you. They're not thinking, oh my god, that. <laughs> the guy just. Oh, he fell? Oh my god, what an idiot. I've never fallen in my entire life. What a dumbass. <laughs> no, they're not thinking that. And I know whenever you do something like that, it's going through everyone's head is, oh my god, everyone's looking at me right now. I should be so embarrassed. They all think I'm stupid. They all think I'm fat. They all think I'm ugly. <laughs> so next time you do something embarrassing, next time you fucking let one rip in class. I mean, the only reason you should ever feel embarrassed about farting in class is if you shit yourself. I mean, if you shart, well, if someone sharted in class, I would consider them more of a legend than they should be embarrassed because sharding I have never seen someone shart in class that would be hilarious <laughs> so guys next time you are in the halls in your school you're walking around you trip you spill all your books everywhere and there is like maybe three or four people looking at you and, and they're laughing if they're laughing at you one those people probably are not very good people and two you are probably the bigger person and if you let this get to you if you see these people and they're like wow these people think I should be embarrassed and these people are trying to make me feel embarrassed. This, those people suck. Those people are not good people. All you gotta do is when something embarrassing happens to so you, really guys, you just gotta shrug it off. No one really thinks you should be embarrassed. The only people that think you should be embarrassed are fucking dickbags and they can just go fuck themselves. 
but everybody else just is probably feeling sorry for you. They're not feeling embarrassed or they're not making fun of you. Just next time you fall, you spill your food, you fart, you shit, you fucking blow diarrhea all over the gym floor. Just think, okay, whatever, I did it. I can't change it at all, so I should really just roll with it and go on with my day because you really can't do anything about it, guys. I mean, I I never, ever, ever get embarrassed. There's nothing that really embarrasses- Oh, shit. Sorry. Hello? Mom? Mom, I'm in the middle of recording a video, okay? I'm sorry. No, I'm not gonna do that right now. Don't get- I, I don't record my videos without pants on, guys. I just took my pants off for that little snippet there. I'm not a pedophile, I don't- Imagine if someone were to walk in on me right now. I am in a shed full of creepy ass stuff with screwdrivers, all this weird stuff, a, a saw. One, I have a camera recording myself. That already looks creepy. And two, I'm not wearing any pants. And I still wouldn't be embarrassed. So I hope you guys enjoy. Enjoyed this video if you did be sure to yeah. kick that like button down below and if you guys want to be in the end slate of my next video just record a video of yourself talking about this very situation how do you feel about being embarrassed do you guys get embarrassed do you think people shouldn't get embarrassed and just title that video with response to the GAK Derek and I'll pick one of you guys to be in my end slate for the next video thank you to the random commenter of the day if you guys want to be the random commenter of the day in my next video, all you gotta do is leave a comment down below answering the question of the day, which is... What is the most embarrassing thing that has ever happened to you? Don't feel embarrassed whatsoever, guys. I have had so many embarrassing stories. Here, let me throw you one really quick. I might have told the story before, but one time when I was a kid, I was swinging from the monkey bars at my j uh, jungle gym at school during recess time, and some guy came over, and he tried to pull down my pants to, like, pants me with my boxers on, but he ended up pulling down my pants and my underwear, therefore my little dingling that I was like five years old was swinging around on the monkey bars with me. And I was very, very embarrassed. If you guys want to follow me on Twitter, the link is in the description below. That is probably one of the best places for you guys to follow me because I am telling you guys when I'm uploading videos, what I'm doing in my daily life, what I have plans to do, and just a bunch of cool stuff. So if you want to be notified of all that stuff, be sure to follow me on Twitter. And lastly, if this is the first video I've ever seen from me, and this is your first time at the VGAK Derek channel, and you want to become an honorary member of the VGAK community, all you gotta do is hit that subscribe button down below, or join the end slate, and you will be an awesome person, and become a member of the VGAK community. I'd like to thank you guys so much for watching and giving me so much support. You guys are so amazingly awesome. I can't even put it into words. I just love you guys so much. Peace out, and as always, I will see you in my next video. And don't be embarrassed, ever! Bye, guys. Woo!